Hey, what's up, guys? It's your boy D Smith. Welcome to D Smith Let's Discuss. Man, today I want to talk about. So now I've been doing a lot of videos, right? Talking about Kwame, Charleston White, uh, Kevin Samuels, um, anything that's related to the uh, to the black culture, right? Hip hop culture. So now I have been getting a lot of, uh, I won't say a lot, but uh, a fair amount of people saying, why you talk about the black people? Another black man dissing another black man. Why? So I've been getting uh, a, a, a few of those. And I was talking to somebody about this, that when you hear some bullshit from somebody in a in a African American community the, from the culture. If you hear some bullshit, are you just supposed to stay quiet and let them keep talking bullshit? If they're African American, Latino, whatever. If you hear some bullshit, do you supposed to keep quiet? Yes or no? My answer is no. If I hear some bullshit, of course I'm gonna challenge that. You just can't let shit go on. You have to ask questions. You have to ask questions. Now, so this is what I have been paying attention to and what's in my uh, world. So, so everybody's gonna be different. So, Dr. Umar Johnson, right? This guy has been talking about building a school for years, for years has not built a school. So are we not to challenge him or question him? For people that have been don donating money, where is where's that money going? Just because that's a black man, I'm supposed to uh, shut the fuck up. That, this one individual saying, why are you talking about black people? So according to that logic, I can't talk about Dr. Uh, Uma Johnson, who, who's full of shit, to some. So Kevin Samuels. I can't talk about Kevin Samuels, even though this guy literally demeans black women. I just supposed to shut the fuck up and not say anything. According to that logic, why are you talking about a black man? Because this nigga is demeaning black females. Now that's his thing, that's his stick, and he's making money off it, so be it. But I have the right to uh, uh, talk about his ass. I have that right. So, another example. Matt Burns and Steven Jackson. Right? So they go on their show and talk about Kwame uh, Brown for like uh, three, three, three podcasts. Literally talking about this man. So according to the logic, don't talk about a black man. I'm supposed to stay out of that shit, right? That's a beat between them, them, uh, them three. No, I have an opinion. I, I can state my opinion. That's, a, lot, a lot of people are too soft now. This is like the softest generation ever. Everybody want a motherfucking light and a motherfucking trophy. When somebody criticizes your ass, you start crying. Why are you criticizing me? Ain't nobody criticizing. I got a motherfucking opinion. The founders of the uh, BLM was uh, P Patrice uh, Colors, if I'm pronouncing that name right. Why are you talking about black people? Man, this lady stole 94 million, allegedly. Don't nobody know where the money is going. <laughs> so I am supposed to just shut up and not say anything. Man, you motherfuckers are crazy. Black people believe anything a nigga say. 
while they emptying your motherfucking po uh, pockets, man. It's just crazy. Uh, black politicians. Now, are we supposed to believe black politicians? Are we not supposed to uh, criticize them? Are we just supposed to shut the fuck up? Think about that. Black politicians, whether Democrat or Republican or independent, because they all full of shit. Uh, we just supposed to uh, believe what they say. Don't criticize that black lady. Yeah, okay. Don't talk about that black man. All right. All these guys emptying your pocket and ain't doing nothing for the community. So, uh, who else? Not like uh, Kwame Brown. I like what he uh, speaking and talking about. He's speaking some uh, some real shit that I can uh, relate to. A lot of people might not can relate to him, but I definitely can't uh, relate to him. Uh, Tommy uh, Tommy uh, Sotomayor. Now I know that nigga is a liar. That nigga is a straight up liar. I'm not supposed to have an opinion on that. The nigga just lie. The nigga just lie. Lie, 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 lie. Full of shit, full of shit, full of shit. But according to that logic, why you attacking a black man? Shit, I look at it, I'm trying to save some of you motherfuckers. I'm trying to save some of you niggas. Open your mind. Open your mind. And stop being one-sided. Take a look at both sides. Far too often, we have the blinders on because we like that person. We have the blinders on. We're not gonna look past their uh their faults, which is wrong and it's crazy. So let's talk about the sport. So Ben Simmons, Ben Simmons has been getting uh, attacked a lot, brother. Right. So, according to this logic, why are you talking about a black man? Man, that, that dude been in the league for four or five years and has no jump shot. By me having my opinion and, and criticizing, hopefully you get motivated from that. Like, yeah, I'm gonna show you niggas, I got a jump shot. So this summer, by me criticizing him, he'll have that motivation and be like, yeah, I got that jump shot now. I got that jump shot. I'm ready for you. Then also, uh, uh, Scotty Pippen just had, he just had an opinion about Kevin Durant. Just an opinion. And when do we start caring about people's opinion, man? When did that shit start? When did that shit start? Who gives a fuck about my opinion, your opinion, her opinion? His opinion, we just care too much about people's opinion and what they think of us. So, man, you, you niggas need to work on your uh, self-esteem. Give a fuck about somebody's opinion. Yo, man, you're going to drive yourself crazy. Can't wait the next person think. So, yeah, for the people that say don't attack uh, black people, you crazy as hell. Black people full of shit. They ass gonna get this motherfucker opinion. It's gonna get criticized. That's just what it is, man. These motherfuckers stealing money. Ain't helping the community. By that lie, y'all just supposed to shut the fuck up. Don't talk about that, black man. <laughs> y'all crazy. Anybody can get it, man. Black, white, Mexican. You want that bullshit, you're going to get this. That's just how I feel, man. Let me know if I'm wrong. Let me know what you think, man. It's your boy D. I'm out of here.